Podcast Ranger. I'm going to post like my new favorite image on YouTube. Oh. Your whip? It's okay if you if you click on it, it's just a list of all the main main cures. Cure whip. And then at one point, it just said Miracle Whip because the two cures in that space are Cure Miracle and Cure Whip. <laughs> Ever. Yeah, I just thought it was. And you love mayonnaise, so. Have you started the show? I do like mayonnaise. Welcome to Extra Extra Castor. Hi, everybody! <laughs> Hello! What's up? It's here. been a long time, but we've got all five casters oh, in the main that. room. That I'm my, Mr. Was, Black. That was my Cramorant. His name is his name is Gary. Gary. Yeah, I need my Cramorant Gary. I love it's been, Gary. It's been many weeks, but we have all five casters here today. We do have all five casters. Yeah, we got good old blue caster, red caster, me gray caster, orange caster, and Sonic. <laughs> yeah, that's not till main show. Oh. Oh. Then never mind. I was waiting um, for someone to go, the, wait. Where's Gar? Where's, where's Gar? <laughs> ah, Jesus Christ! <laughs> Why is it him? But time for a segment that hasn't happened in a while. Jacking break? No, I, I hadn't hit the button yet. <laughs> I, I, I had to come up with a picture real quick. Here's the Bunaga! Oh my gosh, I had so much. No, I, it's, up, it's on top of that. Here's Trump. <laughs> here's <laughs> Lube! Here's Lube! <laughs> it's not for what, what you... It's for it's uh, well the first drawing is not by me but it's uh, I got it it's uh, oh was it that that commissioned you uh no but I do have commission <laughs> stuff hang on I gotta find a picture as some of you might know in the chat uh, I uh, I got a drawing put on me Neat. like that's my tattoo that, that is majestic that's that salty. The fox and salty is my new friend. Are you gonna get another one on your other arm and name it Peppery? Actually, yes. <laughs> Just because oh. you said that, <laughs> I'm gonna spend two hundred dollars to make that joke a reality. Uh, I have, but ac- speaking of actual drawings, I do have some actual drawings. And as I stall to find them drawings. in Discord's piss poor um, interface, hooray! Uh, well, first of all. Uh, just in case, this was mentioned. I, I showed a, a picture of it, but this is Ozurcast for oh, still happening. Oh, so <laughs> Gun George Caster in the chat. <laughs> don't, don't know if uh, if cape or hair. I think uh, it's both. Hair. Oh. Cool. Well, one's hair. Her, her hair is her cape. She's uh, bayonetta. We also have uh, this one. Uh, nice. She grows big. That's literally what I came up with for car. Cool. Um, also, what I also have is, because uh, you guys remember the uh, Masked Rider Girls. I don't know if you've uh-huh. forgotten about them. I tried to. But you f- tried to forget about them? <laughs> uh, well, as you know, two people won, and one of them asked for somebody's Kuga. Um, I'm kidding. Okay. Well, here is uh, not that. <laughs> Here's not Frank. Frank. Wow, it's, wow, it's so lifelike. <laughs> But that's Ishtar Kuga or Kugtar. Kugtar. <laughs> Kugtar. <laughs> that's the best I could come up with. Um, uh, and somebody, so I figured. Well, the other the other person wanted. Oh fuck! I can't remember. Just, I can't. Just, just to clarify, when you when I said I tried to forget about Rider Girls, I meant the band. Oh, because I don't like much of their music. What? No, that's those the, are the common the, Rider the Girls. The prom song from Bars. It was amazing. Um, <laughs> um, let's try together. It was pretty good too. Um, however, there are two goddesses in Fates. One is Ishtar, and the other one was requested, and I can't pronounce her real name, but uh, I came up with a good pun of it. Uh, Mass Rider Girl, Erish Kiagato. Oh, so it's based on Erish Kigal? Yeah. So I, I didn't did... even watch that series, and I knew that name. But see, I did them both, and they... Uh... They look good. Yeah, and they're both uh, in similar poses, but the other way. <gasps> Guys. Well, so you should do like a... Now I have to put them together. together. Yeah. yeah. Damn it. <laughs> yeah, damn it. That's more work for me. That's more work for Sunday morning, Ichi. Yep. F- fuck Sunday morning, Ichi. <laughs> yeah, by the way, sorry that we are recording this episode Saturday instead of Friday, because uh, much of us last night went to see the opening night of Sanic the Hedgehog. Yep. It was fun. We won't, we won't go into spoilers, but you should absolutely go see it, because it was super good. I really liked when Shadow the Hedgehog showed up. Yeah. Dude, don't spoil that. It's pretty good. I, I, I didn't see it, so. <laughs> but does he? No. Oh. Since Tom showed his tattoo. I'm giving that third movie at the earliest. So I, I have a tattoo of the 
an imperial symbol from the Galactic Empire. Because you're a dirty space Nazi. Well, it's also just my representation of my love for Star Wars. Yeah. I've had, um, I've had, I got that in 2013 in Florida. Nice. One more thing i got to show because I'm really Everyone needs it. to stop asking me questions yeah. about the Sonic movie in the chat because I'm either going to spoil something or laugh out loud trying not to spoil something. I updated the design of my Foxona. Nice. Oh, nice sword. Oh, yeah. It is. There's a whole story around that stuff. I don't have any tattoos, but I do have this. <laughs> That's awesome. I no, I, I'm not Emily's laughing at you. Chin I just, I'm just laughing no, at you. No, not the chin. I'm <laughs> laughing at your delivery. It's yeah. like, the I mini have, chin! I don't have a tattoo, I have but pin. I have this pin. <laughs> I have many pins. Anyone who's seen the pictures of my adventure I bag. have the pin yeah. of a... Well, I have many pins. They just had ink on the top, and they went into my arm. Wow. Ow. That's kind of how tattooing works. Anyways. Yeah, right. Currently, right now, Build Hazard and Metal Cluster Hopper are having a battle from to win my heart. Is this a "There's a two wolves inside you" moment? Yeah. <laughs> Which one is the bad one? They're both bad. Yeah. Also, ah! Speaking, speaking of here's First story. I painted this today. Cool. Yeah, yeah, it looks really good. I love the sword. <laughs> oh yeah, the giant ass katana. And no dodge. <sighs> Anyways, we should get into news. Wake the oh, fuck up, Ichi. <laughs> oh, I have some news, but I gotta find it first. Wait, do you have any Pepsis to open? No. <gasps> Let's go get your Pepsis. Talk about the first story. I'll grab your Pepsis. Okay. First news story. Uh, by way of a. Gear manager, cool! <laughs> by way of the second quarter toy catalog, we have confirmation on who the sixth Ranger of Kira Major is going to be, or rather, what color they are. And surprise, surprise for a Sentai based on jewels, but it's going to be Kira May Silver. Uh, the toys listed in this catalog are the Senki Henshin Brace Shiny Kira May Changer, the Senki Drill Kira May Breaker, as well as a soft vinyl figure for Kira May Silver. So it's going to be a Silver Ranger armed with a drill. Get it? Because mining for jewels. Oh, that makes sense. Mm. I also like how we have wrist-mounted transformation. Yes, I'm super hopeful. <sighs> I had to wrestle Cell, but I got them. <laughs> he, he's for some reason sitting right in front of your fridge. Oh, okay. I have no idea why. I, uh, there were no survivors. I was in a live chat no chance of survivors. with uh, the girl who played Asuna. Cool. Oh, sweet. How is she? Wait, why would I? Uh, sorry. Well, she seemed to be in a good... Oh, I gotta scroll all the way back down. Uh, I asked her, I actually had a friend of mine translating because she doesn't speak English, well she either doesn't or didn't. So I had a friend translating, but she could read English. I asked how's Bomba and she says, Bomba, she said Bomba Sen is good. Uh, but cool. the best thing that I did for you guys is uh, I, I said this. If you click on it. Radio Sentai Cast Ranger says hi. Aww. So, and she tried to pronounce it briefly and then moved on. <laughs> I wonder if we can find video of that. Um, it is, it's temporary. I tried to save it, but it's Instagram, so I would have had to use a ripping foot thing to get it. Yeah. It's a, it's a live, so I just screen grabbed it just so you could, you could see it. She mostly was just, you know, saying hi and just answering like very generic questions from what I understood. But she was live. I saw she was live, and I jumped on, and I felt uh, my friend who speaks Japan was able to jump on to kind of uh, translate for me. So she was just kind of just chatting, just sitting there. Cool. She's adorable. So yeah, Lee, now that you're back, uh, Kira Mae Silver with a wrist-mounted henshin device and a drill. Wait, is oh, it's drill. Kira Mae Silver Ranger? Yep. Oh, you is called it, the, it, didn't you? Is yep. it the drill that will pierce the heavens? We can only hope. Wait, so the henshin device is a drill? No, he just has a wrist-mounted henshin brace and a drill called the Kira Mae Breaker. Oh, he's got a wrist-mounted... I like those! Fuck you! No, but I like that the Six Ranger usually has like a different thing. Well, it's a different wrist-mounted thing. No, but see, it's the shiny like Kira Mae Changer. Wait, they, no, I'm pre I'm predicting it now. It's gonna be the exact same model, but like shiny and translucent, cause silver diamonds. No, that's why like it's the not the drills, Blaze. The drill is his weapon. That's why I like the ninja, cause they used swords, and then Star I, I, Ninja I used a hammer. I don't like it when the weapon is the morpher. Yeah. Star Ninja. <laughs> <laughs> we'll we'll get to that. <laughs> Anyways, next. But I like everything. So, there was a posting of quote-unquote upcoming things in Zero One. It was pretty... We're pretty sure this is all fake. But I felt like we should go through this anyway. 
So listed in a quote unquote toy catalog for upcoming things for Zero One was the DX Pro Rising Hopper Progress Key, implying that Zero One's final form was going to be called Pro Rising Hopper. Uh, a learning humor gear progress key for some purpose. A new driver called the Fusion Riser. Another one called the Arc Riser. Uh, and I, I'm waiting for the Paul Riser. <laughs> and, then, uh, and then upcoming forms for other riser or riders. Common Rider Metsubo Vulcan, Jinrai Valkyrie, Arc Thouser, and Common Rider Izu. Ooh, Arc Thouser. Yeah, we're gonna get Common Rider Izu. That has to happen. So these are pretty fake, but I would like to see more forms for everyone, and Comrade Izu seems like something that I like happen. the coffee puff. I actually, that went viral to the fact that somebody messaged it to me from a website, like a, a, a meme <laughs> well, website, awesome. and I'm like, oh yeah, like, do, do you have that one? I'm like, yeah, I have that exact one, and I have that exact coffee. That's, in my belly. It's, it's funny because it's like um, I took a picture of the Jamaican bootleg Pikachu plushie I have and posted it. And Please I, tell me his name was Pokemon! Uh, we, I, I always call it Rasta Chew, but it That's actually good. just says Jamaica, has a Jamaican flag on it, has Jamaican colors. I was watching videos about bootleg toys and I found the pictures I took in my room in that video of nice. that Pikachu, hmm? which was very weird. Alright, next. Boop. Sorry for that. <sighs> oh. Zeo Trinity figure art. Is that bad? Well, I don't like the form. Yeah, this so form is horrendous. I, I liked it, like, in the show. Meaning that I liked the what led up to it being used. I really like the concept of it. Yeah. I will say, if something from Zeo or Zeo Trinity that I do like is I like the Zeo head on the chest and then I like the Gates and Waz shoulder pads. Like, I, I like those. But the head sculpt yeah. is awful. So, no info on price, but the Zeo Trinity figure arts is Tamashi Web exclusive, and pre-orders begin March 21st. It will come packaged with the Psycho Gerade. Uh, additional hands will be included to hold the Zekon Zax and Zekon Despair, but the weapons themselves will not be included. No. Neat. Okay. And by neat, I mean I don't care. Yeah, I'm not getting this at Next. all. Uh, in somewhat related news, we have confirmation for the Soto, uh, Soto stage figures for uh, Zeo, Omaform, and Gates Majesty, which actually look pretty good. They do look good. Yeah. Nice. Yeah, yeah it's all right. Oh, yeah. Neat. Uh, it's so the... they posed them with their heads off for the. Yeah. Well, it's just, just to show to like, what pieces... how it's going to come in the box. Yeah, because these got... figures you have to assemble. Thumb assembly first. required. Uh, so both sets will be released on February 24th. Neato. Also in Soto Stage news, fucking Metal Cluster Hopper. <gasps> Ooh. I'm getting the Rider Kick figure, so. Yeah. Though the Soto figure does still look pretty nice. That's why I like that he's like mainly like one solid color. Because yeah. it really helps. Uh, he will come with the Progrise Hopper Blade. Cool. And I like you guys got a picture of him just choking out Thouser. Yep. Uh, so that one's coming out in March. Alright. Next! Premium Bandai announces Cure Major t-shirts. And some of these designs are actually really good. Yeah, I know. They look really good. So we have individual ones of each of the five majors. That's rad. Oh, I, I, uh, I have, I have a, um... A toy scan that I discovered that I don't know if you've covered. Did you guys cover the uh, Necrom key yet? Uh, nope. There's a Necrom key? There is a Necrom key. Let me show it to you. Mm-hmm. Look, <laughs> you're ready for it. Mm-hmm. Yeah, get it? The <laughs> Allen key. <laughs> I knew it. Oh High five, Tom. That was pretty good. <laughs> I literally would built a swivel chair the other day. I took a picture of that to make that joke. <laughs> That's great. That's amazing. Get, get out! <laughs> <laughs> wow. My work here is done. Yeah. Anyway, back to the t-shirts. We have the second design, which I actually like a lot more. It's a, a solid black shirt with the little poses from their sashes. You see, those are for when you want to support your fandom, but you want to be sure that nobody recognizes Yeah, it. These, these are shirts you could safely wear in public. Like, I think if I walked so with somebody the other way and I saw that... I give it maybe a 20% chance I'd catch it. Yeah. Like, you know, but however, however, 
there is a time approximately five years from now when you're going to see kids wearing this. Yeah. Uh, so these shirts go for 38.50 yen, tax included, shipping in April. If they were cheap and we were all getting one, I would get one. If I could get one in my size, absolutely, but probably not. Yeah. None of them size shirt fit pretty well. Yeah. Well, those were customs. Were they? Yeah. Oh. Okay. So I'd have to, like, take this image and put it onto a custom website, which is well, effectively if were, counterfeiting. If, if, well, if you were going to if you were gonna rip a design, <laughs> that'd be the one to rip. Because yeah. it'd be A, be easy, and B, I'm pretty sure they have copyrighted shapes. Yeah. They can't copyright lines. Yeah. Anyway, next. Premium Bandai announces Geki Ranger merchandise. Ooh. <gasps> oh, yeah, stuff from Scratch. Is that how you pronounce that? Because it's spelled S C R T C. Yeah, it's, 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 it's the Scratch Sporting it's Goods Company. Scratch. No, it's Scratch Sporting oh, Goods fuck. Company. I, you know what? I like. I don't think they'd make it in my size, but if I really want to make like like uh, like what do we call Tasha? Mooncaster. Mooncaster. No, Doomcaster. Doomcaster. If you want to make Doomcaster's fucking life. Because she, A, loves Ge- she loves Geki Ranger. Well, you should send her this. Yeah. So, on Twitter, someone uh, made what the build as just rabbit would look like. Oh, that looks good. And, because, oh. you know, you got to complete the set. Tank. Bam! That's, Damn. That is, that is pretty. Uh, those are two different shades of blue. I call bullshit. You can push it. I know the rabbit one though. That's my aesthetic right there. Oh, that's nice. You know the rabbit eyes are fucking great. That's why Evolve rabbit form looks so good. Yep. Yeah. That's my right, how much do you want me to guess? How much this uh, the, this uh, the shirts are? This shirt is two hundred bucks. Like the tracksuit. Uh, I, I I'm I'm gonna guess it. Yeah, I'm gonna guess one hundred and seventy five dollars. I'm guessing two hundred. Emily, do you want to guess? Um, I'm not sure. Um, I, I maybe two fifty. Uh, the Scratch track jackets will go for sixty fifty and tax included. Well, I went over a lot. But shit, that's like that's sixty bucks. That's like eighty yeah. dollars. Yeah, that's pretty good. Well, you know what? For stuff like it's it's the sh- it's the stuff like a shirt that uh, that fucking that, gets. yeah, and that's just for the jacket. Man, I guess we were both wrong. So they're also putting out the pants, of course, and those go for forty nine fifty yen. Yeah. So technically, if you add up both of them, you were still over. Yeah. You know what? That's affordable. Yeah. If it well, the shipping, it's it's not quite worth it. You know, for like if they had them in the colors, that'd be pretty cool. Yeah. Like if you could get them in like red, yellow, blue, white, or purple. And uh, so aside from the prices, those are all shipping out in June, and pre-orders are now open. And then they're also putting out a backpack. Now that I would buy. So that's sixty fifty n shipping in April. Oh, I I legitimately actually might look into buying that. Well, if you're interested, you can talk to our sort of sponsor. It came from Japan. Oh, sweet. That's where we get all our toku stuff from. Right. That's reminding me of the Grid Battle Force backpack we were yeah. supposed to get. We are not releasing it. You know you know what I could put in that backpack? My laptop, which can now play Raid Shadow Legends on mobile <laughs> and on PC. <laughs> well, you're right. You skipped the dishes. Yeah. Just don't use DoorDash. Put your food in the backpack. I'm not saying oh. that, that DoorDash is run by Nazis, but they didn't say they did weren't. Yeah. They haven't gone on record saying it isn't. Denny, <laughs> Denny's does uh, skip the dishes now. Oh, this is cool. It's got this little like pocket that attaches to one of the straps. Put your cell phone in there. Yeah. yeah, so the thieves know where to hit you. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay, I'll just read, it's okay, I'll just read. You'll be right in the you gotta be right in the phone. This bag can really scratch your itch if you know what I'm saying. No, so you, it's like, oh, you, I thought you got shot. No, I'm fine. In this pocket, I keep my extra large piece of the Dead Sea Scroll. <laughs> Thank God I was wearing a piece of the Bible. Anyways, next. Hey, man, it's all about reps, rips, and revelations. Speaking of revelations. Anyone who can tell me what that's from gets to pick the rider. Sadly, I don't know. New- rips, reps, and revelations. In the meantime, a new entry for the Lightning Collection has been revealed. Oh, I saw these. Rita and Zed from Mighty Morphin. Yeah, well, he's regretting the day that he opened Bandora's box. <laughs> oh my god. I've been saving that since I saw that earlier on in the week. Yeah, so we're getting a Lightning Clutch figure of Rita to celebrate the 25th wedding anniversary of Lord Zed and Rita Repulsa. Oh, that and makes so, me sad, though. Because it's their anniversary. And the, be- oh. the, the best part about this set is, if you go down, it comes with, uh, if you look on the first picture... 
Oh, it's <laughs> <laughs> oh, tiny on our ends. Oh, okay. Well, they're tiny. Anyways, it comes with their wedding cake. That's awesome. Oh, cool. Let me, uh, so let me tell you a David Asselrod story real quick. Uh, one time at um, oh, yeah, that, no. uh, went at uh, Quinty Minicon when he was there. Uh, he had this uh, little, you know, the Lord Zed action figure from the nineties. Uh-huh. He had, uh, now I had it on its table on you know the, on the Saturday and on the Sunday we're putting him in the car to go back to the con. So oh, wait, no, no, you have to go. And we had to send a person back because he didn't want to go to his table without the toy because he's like, huh? They need I need to represent. And uh, his whole thing is, you know, he was like older than hell before he was old. Uh, he couldn't, he could do the voice, but he couldn't do any kind of face or anything. So what he would do is he would kind of hide himself away and he would do a little Lord Zed voice with the figure. And it was so cute. Hmm. So what's cool about this release in particular is this is in fact a two-pack of Rita and Zed. And it's being referred to as the Silver Wedding Anniversary Special. Because it has been 25 years since the airing of the episode where they got married. Their, Jew- their traditional space Jewish wedding. Oh, God. But, uh, yes, it was, Thunder uh, Brester. That was from Letter Kenny. So, uh, for those interested, this will be exclusive to GameStop, releasing in August for a modest $50 US. That's not bad. For a two-pack and a cake. Yep. So, Thunder Brester Orb, I'm going to need you to pitter-patter and pick a rider. <laughs> Cool. All right. Next, uh, Bandai has announced the Super Mini Plug QQ Sentai Gogo Five Victory Robo, aka the Lightspeed Rescue Megazord, and put out images of it. Yeah, it looks good. That it, does look. Good. It looks pretty good. You yeah, think like a lot of the? Um, that is it, pretty cool. it even comes with stretching arms because it's fire ladder. Because a lot of the Zords back then were pretty crappy. Yeah. <laughs> So this comes with all five of the QQ machines. Red Ladder, Blue Thrower, Green Hover, Yellow Armor, and Pink Aider. Pink Horby. Horby the pink one or the or which one's Horby? And the Horby's the yeah, the pink bird one. What? What? Oh, oh for the writer, uh Thunderbreaster wants oh, me to oh, do Oh Horby is oh yeah, Conrad of Horby is the purple scorpion one. Oh purple scorpion one, okay. Yeah. Um, but yeah, so we don't yet have price or release date for Victory Robo, but I'm sure we'll be finding out soon. Yeah. Neat. Next. Toei Tokusatsu. I just think they're neat. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Toei Tokusatsu Fan Club has announced a Super Sentai Party variety program. Uh, this is going to celebrate the release of Kira Major. The first episode will, indu- will introduce the main cast and production of Kira Major. Uh, the presenters for each episode are Yosuke Ito, who was Deca Green, uh, and Super Sentai fan Miyajiman Sakura. Miyajiman! And the second episode will feature interviews with each of the cast members of Kira Major, and new episodes of Sentai Party going forward will be put out each Saturday. Man, for a second I thought that was something much cooler than it was. Yeah, like it's you just can... they're doing a weekly interview show. No, I picture like, you know how you get those Disney princess parties that you can throw for your kids? Imagine oh, like, yeah. a Super Sentai Super party Sentai. where they just like... <laughs> send show... toy actors to your house. Yeah, and well, you've got the package like you could pay and, you know, they'll send like Zero One to your house. Or, <laughs> or you get the cheap package and they send like, like, Gates or, uh, <laughs> or Banjo. <laughs> oh, it's like, it's, it's my favorite. Yeah. Neat. All right. It's like one of those things where in your head you picture it as being much cooler than what it actually is. Yeah. Like I found out they were going to do, uh, uh, there is a uh, Stranger Things Dungeons and Dragons. And I thought, and there, it turns out that it's just the module they played in Stranger Things. But at first I thought, it, I, I was like, oh, it's your characters in oh, in that in their town during, during the events of Stranger Things. But that way you could play Dungeons and Dragons inside a session of Dungeons and Dragons. Like, wouldn't that be cool? That would be cool. Men as fuck. But, yeah. But now I want a rider party. A super soft rider party. <laughs> body! The body! 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 P-A-R-T-Y! God, I love that song. I've come around on it. I don't think it fits the movie, but it's a good song. It doesn't song. matter. It doesn't matter if it fits the movie or not. Now, you know what? My goal for 2020 is that we're going to have a super soft rider party. <laughs> Speaking of movie parties... Uh, apparently there's some possibilities sprouting up that superhero Tyson movies might be coming back. Oh? So, there's... I mean, I kind of, I, they were, they've been a little shitty lately, especially with the last, <laughs> the 
well, no, especially with Cho superhero Tyson, that was just garbage. But uh, no, if they brought them back, I'd be happy. So the there was a spy shot taken showing a bunch of shocker Centoian uh, all huddled around toy producer Shirakura. Uh, and people are saying that this could hint at the Comrade or Tyson movies coming back. Yeah. So, that might be happening. That'd be cool. Who's behind me? It's it, it's a Gar. It's Sonic! <laughs> Gar is questioning why. Well, why we're bringing back the Tyson movies? P-A-R-T! Why?! Why you don't want to see the Kira Majors beat the shit out of Zero One? If you don't like it, you tweet at him. I've done. I've tried my hand on that already. <laughs> these, these movies make money, but they're, they're shit. I bet you at the end they're gonna fight a giant CG creation that's half Shocker and half whatever the monster is current thing. It's half Shocker and half Shirakura. Yeah. <laughs> Garnet the Hedgehog. Gotta go at my own speed. <laughs> Gotta go slow. Anyways, that's the news. All right, Gar, can, can you either move to one side or another? Somebody standing right behind me is kind of one of my not great things. Gotta go slow. Much better. <laughs> Do you want to come back? No. That's a no. In or out, there is no bow. You left. There is no try. And Gar leapt out, and hopefully, hoping that the next leap would be his leap home. <laughs> Quantum Leap? <laughs> yeah, that was just a Quantum Leap. Quantum Gar. Gar. <laughs> Garntum Leap. Garntum Leap! <laughs> I like, I like Garntum Leap. Now I want there to be like a like a poster for Quantum Leap, but it's just Gar is two pants. Yeah, I got a two pants with a Quantum Leap poster. Someone will have that logo done. Just, just yeah. go back and I'm Gar? <laughs> just, How did they know? <laughs> <laughs> just Gar leaps into either like me or Chris, and you know, just, what's with all of this random back pain? Yeah. And we're just like when whatever eat we're in like Gar's body going enjoy. Jackpot! You guys wouldn't want to jump into my body. My head is a place that no one wants to be. In. Well, it would be in our bodies. Your head. We probably wouldn't be able to walk though. You know, with your because you, you've got your leg figured out. We'd just like oh fuck it, just fall right down. Oh my hip! <laughs> Anyways, yeah. before this gets too weird, that's Is that extra. Four? Yeah, that's extra. Okay. Oh, that was it. That extra was pretty extra. Yeah. Blue well, extra. We'll hear you on the podcast proper, and we'll see you next week. Thank you for listening. Sweet. See you next week. I gotta come up with a bit. <laughs>